Jennifer Lopez is taking time for herself and focusing on her future, the on-the-floor hitmaker 55, who filed for divorce from her ex-husband Ben Affleck on August 20, is not bitter over her failed marriage. A source close to the pair revealed on Friday, the insider told People that although this has been one of the hardest years for Jennifer, she is prepared to move forward as a single woman and prioritize her career. She didn't want to file for divorce. She just felt like she had no choice. Nothing was going to change with Ben, the source revealed. According to court documents, the pop star and the Hollywood hunk listed their date of separation as April 26, which came as no surprise to fans as they spent summer 2024 on opposite coast, but true to her positive outlook on life, she's moving forward with optimism. Instead of feeling like she's fallen flat on her face, she sees it was meant to be. She's taking time for herself right now. And she has no bad feelings toward her dear Ben and dear Ben, PT2 Muse. Instead, she is choosing to focus on their good memories. She knows she lives a privileged life in so many ways. She's very grateful for all the beautiful memories with Ben. But she's now focused on creating the best future for herself and her kids, the source finished. The pair, lovingly dubbed Benifer, first started dating in 2002 after playing lovers on set of Geely, 2003, and quickly got engaged but they split up in 2004, just before they were set to become husband and wife. They both went on to wed other people, she exchanged vows with Mark Anthony in 2004, while he walked down the aisle with Jennifer Garner in 2005, but after splitting from their respective partners, they eventually found their way back to each other, they rekindled their romance in 2021 and finally said, I do in Las Vegas in July 2022. Their assets are currently up in the air as Ben and Jen did not sign a prenuptial agreement before tying the knot. The inside information comes just days after Jennifer broke her silence on the split, in a candid cover story for Interview magazine. In the interview published Wednesday, the Let's Get Loud singer said the breakup feels lonely, unfamiliar, scary. Feels sad. Feels desperate. The songstress emphasized her willpower to move forward, accepting she has learned that lesson. Oh, 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 oh,